Okay, hello everyone. Um, okay, this is a quick tutorial on how to set up Arduino. And if you haven't checked the video that Raymond uploaded, how to install Arduino and the Neo library, check it out. Uh, yeah, this is a really pretty accurate video and tutorial. And thank you, Raymond, for that. And if you have any problem going through this setup, uh, installing, just uh, contact us through Facebook or the support ticket. Okay. And yeah, we're going to start opening Arduino. And this is how Arduino comes by default. And there's a couple of changes you need to do. Uh, go to File, Preferences. Uh, this is the same thing for um, Mac. And you're going to check this guy over here, display line numbers. And pay attention here on the left of the sketch what happened. You see? Now you have all the line numbers. That is going to help you a lot in the future. And the second thing, let me show you first what happened uh, before we do the change. Uh, I'm going to compile an empty file pretty much and check the progress bar stops right there and, and you might think that the software crash or I don't know but no actually uh, there is a lot of things going on underneath the hood and probably it's a good idea to do this you go again file preferences and you're gonna check compilation and upload these two guys here you close Arduino, open again and let's see the difference what is really going on here uh, uh, open so you can see everything and check it out yep there's a lot of things going on and, and this is a pretty much empty project but in reality Arduino is doing a lot of things for you this, uh, there's a lot of settings that you have to set on a microcontroller and that's the reason why Arduino is a perfect entry level for microcontroller because it's very frustrating to set up uh, a microcontroller for the first time and Arduino is doing a great job uh, hiding that for you and just doing it for you. And now let's check what's happened when we do uh, a Neo compiler. It's gonna happen just as the other one. Uh, it's gonna take a little bit the first time. Uh, this is the first compiling and it's compiling all the libraries that you're using. And if I change everything or even one uh, byte Look what happened, it's really fast. Okay, so every time that you do this for the first time, yeah, it's gonna take a little bit, and the second time it's gonna be okay. Now let me show you another thing why you need these numbers over here. I'm gonna make a mistake here, a purpose. Comma, show me there. Uh, compile and boom look at this I have an error and you might have more errors uh, after that and don't worry about that only check the first one and it's telling you the on the line 310 okay 310 on the 15 character which pretty much shows that that's, uh, that's an error Compile again. Yeah. And let's see what happened with programming. It's pretty much the same. It's a different information, but um, let's do that. And it's compiling. Now it's writing. You know what's going on. And now it's verifying. And boop, that's it. So file preferences and we had 
compilation, upload, and display line numbers. So this is your setup. Thank you for watching.